Hello, fellow heck razzlers. Pardon my voice today, but uh, I'm Cray with Surface Water Solutions. As we gear up for our October course coming up on New Zealand's South Island, you can see the details over here on the right. Um, I thought we'd have a little bit of fun first, um, with no offense to the Kiwis here, but with some sheep. Now, I don't know if you've ever seen drone footage of sheep herding, um, but if you are a true hydro nerd like me, it might just remind you of particle tracing. You might see the sheep forming some flow separation lines, some um, maybe some backwater eddies, some vortices, and some other familiar looking patterns. If you look here closely, you might see a couple of the sheep running around the wrong direction. Uh, there's your backwater vortex, and there's your flow separation line. Um, I thought we'd have a little bit of fun first thing if we can use HECRAS to replicate what the sheep are doing here. So let's move these things out of the way. And uh, let's go to New Zealand's South Island over here on the left. Um, we zoom in on this and see if we can find us some sheep. There's Otago and uh, looks like the Misty Mountains if you're a token fan. And what do you know when we zoom in real close, we might actually see our sheep right there. So uh, let's flood their pens now uh, with Hecras and let's see what happens. Uh, all I've done here is to put some uh, terrain modification in to build the fences in, and what do you know? Looks like we've got ourselves an analog system here. So if you're interested in learning to use HECRAS and HEC HMS for something that's maybe just a little more practical than this, um, then please go to our website and register your interest for our upcoming Christchurch course. Sign up for uh, any or all of the modules and bring along your own terrain files. And we'll just end up building and animating models from scratch by the end of the course. We'll have some tutorials for you, but uh, bring your own along if you want to customize it. Hope to see you in Christchurch. Thanks.